What's up? It's your boy, Ken and Scott. Back at you again. Live and direct. Back to back weeks. Had to come back to Milpitas. Had to get some more reps on the spine. Had to get some more reps on the A box. And it's the middle of the week. So I figured it'd be empty, and it is. So I've been getting some reps in on the bowl, reps in on the spine. I'm gonna see about maybe putting together some answers to the questions that were in the comments about how to approach spine. So I'll do a couple more reps, film some more, and maybe give a little explanation of what I do, and then reference some other videos that people have made like Ricardo about how to tackle spine. I'm not all the way back on spine like I was before, still haven't quite mastered spin yet, and we'll see what happens. Stay tuned, people. If you're new, this channel is literally about my return to blading after a traumatic brain injury that I suffered while doing a basic soul grind. But I wasn't wearing a helmet, y'all. So I stress this enough. In every video, I stress it. Skate safe so you can skate forever. Upgrade your gray matter, strap it up. If you like this message, you like these videos, if you like my skating, maybe you like when I talk about other random stuff too, do subscribe, get notifications so when the beat drops, you're ready to spit flows Wait, that's not how that works. That's how it works for me. I'm about to get it in. This is fun, it's empty. Let's go, y'all. Quick little ditty while I got a second inside of the quarter pipe. I think what's key for me when doing spine, and as I practice it all day today, I'm gonna keep refining this, but I wanna make sure that my feet go as high up the spine as possible before I tuck my legs in. Two things that I always do wrong. You'll see it. I jump too early, and then I actually feel like I'm jumping, and I don't ride enough, or I don't go up, and I go out. If you go out, you're gonna flat bottom every time. It's the spine, it's tiny. You almost wanna feel like you're gonna go up and come straight back down on it, which is like the scariest thing in the world. But that's like the actual spine feelings that you're going straight up and coming straight back down. The other thing that really helps me a lot is I try to aim my toes and my actual front wheels right to the coping. Like I wanna stay on the quarter pipe all the way to the point where my toes are almost clipping and then I wanna pull them in. I think that because I know that I'll never let that happen and that as soon as my toes get really close, I'm gonna pull them in anyway. But if I think that I wanna let them touch, then I stay on a little bit longer, which allows me to float. So I'm gonna do a couple more shots from under so you can see exactly where I'm releasing. And maybe this will help those who asked last week, how do I do spine? What are some pointers? Ricardo Lino has an awesome video. I watched that. It's very similar in its understanding, but it's a smaller spine. He does a really cool like double little leg kick. I have not figured that out yet. But I'm gonna take some shots from below. All right, y'all, if y'all was with me last week, you know that I got to Milpitas and I learned about this box and I had to get down. So I'm coming back for more. I'm gonna hit it from this side, from the other side, try to go up, down, feeling inspired by the homies, feeling inspired by this dope park, and I'm ready to get it in on something new. Of that time to go on to flat up back down 
really, really liked this last time I was here, so I'm gonna get a couple reps in for sure. The down box, it's cool. Not that exciting, to be quite honest. Um, so I'm gonna move on. I did some tricks, did quite a bit of tricks. I think if I were doing 42 for 42, I could probably lace a bunch more. Um, maybe that's a good idea to come here and do my 42 for 42, get down on all these boxes. But I think right now, it's about going up, down. Let's go. So, quick update on the Fruit Tech hardware. I was out here last week, skating, skating, skating. Bolts came a little loose again. So I reached out to Jonathan, the homie from Fruit Tech, Jonathan Haynes, shout out. And I was like, bro, I need some help. They're not staying in. So he sent me another set. The Adapt hardware is super long. Let's be real clear about that, it's super long. So I don't know whether my boot it's starting to warp after two years. Maybe an update on that to come. Or these screws are still not long enough, but they're 24 millimeters. And I feel it now, clicking again. My right foot came undone earlier. My left foot's coming undone now. I'm gonna reach back out to the homie. What's dope about skater-owned companies like Fruitech is that they're actually responsive. They understand our needs. They wanna make quality products. So I know, I trust, that Jonathan will send me something new to try and see if it works, but, but this latest round is just not there yet. So I know them parts, been tested a bunch. I'm sure Rosie's and others, I'm part of the ADAPT test team, so gracious to be part of that. And I'll send him back the feedback, you know? You gotta send the feedback so that you get results. I gotta send the feedback, but for now, I gotta pause again, go fix my skates. Be right back, y'all. one of those days it's just not gonna happen today come out come out again as long as you don't get broke you can always try and try so I'm gonna pause got a meeting in five minutes zoom meeting I look like hell you know work life so I'm gonna shut it down for today I'll be back here back to this a box for sure got way more to do it was a good day though really nice to get out and skate solo session so I didn't have to worry about timing just getting myself out of the house. Really appreciate y'all joining me. 2660, something like that number of subscribers. So 20, 2660 means that we are this, this close to 3000. June is the three year anniversary of Blading on the Brain, this channel and my journey and making a diary of what it's like to come back after a traumatic brain injury that's suffering on something like this, to be quite honest. So scary, always scary, always something I'm thinking about, but the joy of rolling is too much. I gotta do it, sets me right. So, but I'm gonna wrap it up for today before I get broke off. Good day on the spine, good day otherwise. Ew. So I'm gonna wrap it up. Do sub, thumbs it up, share these videos with your peoples, let them know there's more to talk about than just tricks, but that the tricks are hot too. See y'all next week. I'm out fam.